Okay, let's see. The Schumann resonance went up to 8.5. Okay, well, I will, I will say this. Well, we are, we are, the simulacrum is in a state of entropy. And I've said this in, I think, four different videos where I explain that uh, Elliott Wave Theory promotes the idea that we are also like in a simulation and that it's counting down. And I am 100% that he, correct. I, I'm, I'm, I'm on board with that. We are in a simulation and it is counting down. There are four definitive resets in the very near future. Many of you listening to this video are going to be alive in, uh, <coughs> in, 19, in 19 years from now. 19 years and one month, less than one month from now. We're going to go through the 2040 reset. <coughs> a quarter of the world's population will, will die. And this is in the literature. It's very, uh, Book of Revelation, Book of Isaiah are very, very specific about it. Uh, the next one after that is six and a half years later in November. It's another type of reset. But this one is not a reset where people vanish or cities uh, are, 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 are liquefaction just sinks their areas. This is an absolute movement of the earth. As a matter of fact, my very last video concerns it. My last two videos concern the movement of the earth, the Mayan long count, what's going to happen in 2046. But then a very unusual reset is going to happen in the year 2070. This is a year that I, uh, even a... Uh, uh, Sir Isaac Newton was very interested in this time period, but uh, 2070 is not something I really want to get into right now. Uh, I, man, I hate, I, I sound so hypocritical when I tell you I'm not a Christian, but then I'm going to sit here and tell you that millions of people, or maybe even more than millions of people, are going to vanish in the year 2070. Because uh, you're going to say, oh, you, oh, you believe in the rapture, you believe in so, uh, Human physiology is going to change to the extent that you're not going to be able to die, not easily. The scriptures and the prophecies are very, very specific about the time period coming when people are going to beg to die, but they can't because they heal too fast. So <coughs> we're not going to get into all that. The greatest reset's coming in 2106. Resets, though, are still a continuation of the paradigm of the simulation that we exist within now. You have to understand that. We're still in the simulation even beyond these four resets. The simulation itself does not stop until the year 2178, which the Archaics Paradox, my video on the Archaics Paradox explains that number, what that number means. It's 138 years, a Phoenix cycle after Phoenix in 2040 is the year 2178 Annus Mundi. So, uh, yeah. With the Schumann resonance, absolutely correct. But it's a it's a it's a resonance that actually defines decay. It is it is a measurable entropy. Uh, the sim the simulation may have a power source that is fading, and it and it causes a quickening. Things begin to unravel faster. Now, for those of you who aren't really following Schumann resonance or Elliott wave theory or the simulacrum, let me explain it this way. For thousands of years, we've all been living in different simulations and they, be, they have begun coalescing. The more people come in contact with each other, the more globalization brings us all together, the more that coding, coding is assimilated into a unified program. All these simulations from all these different cultures and time periods are all converging in our life right now. This is what's happening. This is what the simulacrum is. It's not one simulation, it's manifold, it's many, and they're all converging. But what happens, just like with any sophisticated AI software, you know, you gotta understand, AI doesn't exist, it's a marketing gimmick, but it just means a increase in computation power to where it mimics human intelligence. So, <coughs> with, all these with all these simulations converging, we have coding errors. Sometimes weird things happen. We don't understand. We're watching the news and someone says something that we know couldn't have possibly been said 24, 24 hours earlier. You couldn't have. We, no one in the world would have ever been able to believe that something like that would have been shown on television or seen. Or gremlins, things that come up missing in our immediate environment, only to be found exactly where we had searched for them before. 